this week, I want to talk about another important topic having to do with energy in your read. It's not only important, it's pretty much essential that you maintain the same energy that you begin a script with to the very last word of that copy. Remember now, we're not talking about speed here, but energy. Speed can change, but energy rarely, if ever, does. It's interesting how often this happens, but I'll be teaching class and I'll be listening to one of my students give a tremendous read on a commercial or a piece of narrative copy, and then all of a sudden, at the very end of the script, they'll pull up short. It's like they're giving the last couple of lines short shrift. Like all of a sudden they've run out of energy or they just don't care. I mean, hell, it is the end of the script, right? I mean, I feel like I'm watching a race where the leading sprinter is streaking toward the finish line, but inconceivably slows up just before they make it to the tape. I mean, what good is running that whole race if you don't run through the tape? It's an odd phenomenon, but it happens way too often. And it not only happens at the end of a script, but often within the body of a script as well. Let me give you an example. I'm going to say something I said a bit earlier again, first with the proper energy and then with the energy sagging at the end. Speed can change, but energy rarely if ever does. Speed can change, but energy rarely if ever does. Now, if an ad agent or producer or client is listening to you and you approach the end of the script or sentence with that lack of commitment you just heard, they are going to think you just don't have the stamina to work on their job. And that's the last thing you want them to think because then you won't be working in the industry much longer if that's what you get a reputation for. Now, the easiest way to keep your energy flowing and consistent all the way through to the very end of your read is to keep playing. Play doesn't have any boundaries, it doesn't have any cutoff points, it doesn't know the meaning of the word stop. Your body and your spirit have a boundless energy, certainly enough to get through to the end of that copy. So have fun, enjoy what you do from the very first word of that copy through to the last. And don't end up being that runner that stops short of winning that race, okay? You keep that energy flowing and you will be doing yourself a huge favor. And don't just stop there. I mean, your career needs that kind of full-on energy. The world needs that full-on energy. So don't just stop on the copy. Bring it out to the world. Let them know you're there.